Hi Libra, thank you so much for tuning in. Welcome to Tarot Solar Sun Studio. I am Caro. We are going to find out the fortunes uh, in 2024. Happy New Year. I'm going to use a set of cards. Uh, first, I'm going to start with exploring your fortunes for the New Year 2024. So our first message, we have the goals. The second message is we have the eagle symbolism and we have also the sun. Okay, so the fortune seers, uh, by the way, this is literally fortune reading cards. Uh, the fortunes are showing Libra energy. Um, making their way forward towards a target, an aim. Um, yes, that can be, of course, a lot of goals here to accomplish, but there is also uh, a message how you also move with other people, especially people who are coming towards you. Uh, because they can also contribute valuable insight and these people can also take you there. Uh, it's like you are jumping on an eagle and like um, flying over uh, its wings. So this is this this can be also like a, of course like a spirit animal, but also like a guide. Uh, so like to 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 a better place where you can. Um, then have the most of the outcome uh, you will have uh, which is even truly opening your heart and uh, here you are achieving some type of a, um, enlightening view in front of you so it's like actually goals achieved but the thing is that let's uh, take our cards for me just a sec please Let's, let me uh, get the card, or let me put like this for myself. It's going to be better, and this one. Okay. Um, let me add some uh, tarot cards to that. Let me, oh, Ace of Cups, nice. Seven of Wands, this is for Eagle. Yeah, Nine of Cups, the Wish card, Libra. Very, very nice. Uh, there can be here also a love story, but here the love uh, is likely to emerge, or a partnership, it's likely to emerge uh, with a common goal with a person, which is, uh, and I feel like this person, or maybe this group of people, or uh, this collaborator, or this counterpart, have really um, a lot of things to offer. Uh, but it's like they are telling you this is not going to be easy. Even they are the ones like who will take you there. Uh, I feel here, uh, maybe at the beginning of 2024, you are tapping into many potentials. And you are somehow see those potentials um, uh, with, a, with a positive viewpoint and like adapting them to your personal goals as well. Um, and then this, this gives you a sense of purpose and it's like saying, this is my Dharma, this is the place I have to move, for, move forward. The st strength here is so important. Um, at some point, there can be some resistance though, okay? Like that, there is, um, how to say, let's say, uh, around uh, maybe mid parts of the year, uh, you may also uh, show maybe some resistance uh, 
to some type of a situation but it's like I think your the person here you will engage in or your again counterparts is like very much encouraging you um, here you are investing in connections and relationships as well uh, as well as your goals I have to say yes we have the also the flames on the heart Flames on the heart is like, uh, you can think of it like a place where the heart is like lit. Uh, it indicates this prosperousness, um, like a place where meal is cooked, you know, like, so there is this uh, heat, it is, it is very good. Um, and this is, I think, the potential itself. It's interesting you have both the uh, water and the fire energy here. Like you feel and you act on it. Uh, we have also here um, some good benefits of uh, your well-being. If you can really um, invest also in your well-being, Libra France, uh, when it comes to health or other matters, you are really going to benefit from this investing in health and in your well-being because here there is some type of also a, a, how do they put it like a physical performance okay like your stamina let's say um, I think by the um, mid years you may feel like some things are really taking shape for you um, but you are also uh, seizing in the situation uh, more courage or more determination is also needed um, this is really something uh, so motivating um, and within you there, there can be also this willing to fight for your truth and what you are believing in um, you maybe sometimes go uh, and take this break, break uh, of standing in your gr ground, like collecting your breath and then moving forward. Um, as at that moment, you may see your challenges and you may uh, ready to face with like uh, new challenges after you collect your breath. There is some kind of a uh, profit and gain matter here, Libra, and this profit and gain, uh, because this is going, there is going to be also a financial outcome for this. Uh, after you have firmly held off your competition or, um, let's say, enemies, okay, uh, there is definitely a profit and gain here um, there is a point here when you oh my goodness so beautiful cards with the shepherd card this is when you have strong love for something for life um, feeling life very strong and nine of cups with the sun you are really at a good point here like uh, you know looking back and you will be like so much uh, proud of yourself when you look back and decided that you took this ro road, you took this uh, path. Um, you know, this may at times may feel like a bustle before the victory. See, the seven of ener one's energy, it's a very interesting uh, psychology it actually brings it's like when you feel let's say outnumbered in your determined uh, in a situation but it's like your determination actually will win the day there is a here a sacrifice from your time and energy that you got to also make each day this is really uh, important because your daily progress in something will be very important because this is going to help you to discover your inner resources. 
um, those in our inner resources maybe before you have suspected from from them uh, but actually you are later using them to overcome uh, those obst obstacles uh, thus you will have of course the advantage and will eventually nine of cups you will achieve the desire of your heart this is not just achieving su success uh, i think in general uh, throughout 2024 there can be many chances to um, grasp that good standard of life okay good standard of uh, life uh, it's incredible it's incredible to see the nine of cups here the the flames uh, on the heart uh, so much energy of a neutralization of um, beginning circumstances in which you think maybe that will be an obstacle but it's important really to what others are offering you uh, creating those aim and goals um, because there is also some type of a financial achievement here investing in your health all will be very important um, it's like everything you want and hope for in by the end is it going to be easy it's not a easy road with the eagle seven of wands and of course the three here uh, of course represents the uh, fulfillment our highest uh, hopes and uh, that it gets tough it's like you will um, stop by and remind yourself those hopes so eyes on the price as they say uh, just at the beginning you really need to decide on what you really want okay what you want because uh, it's likely that you will get it this is uh, what i feel i want to get uh, some uh, other news for this reading now this is the art of life deck it's a very interesting deck it's a uh, art deck art artist uh, arty deck and uh, there are also some quotes uh, on them from famous uh, writers, philosophers, uh, artists uh, for the things they are known for. Let's see what we will get. Uh, but of course, it's a tarot deck. Uh, okay, temperance. Now, this temperance here, uh, here is your... Uh, painting let's say something inspirational for the 2024 so this is a woman washing her feet in a brook this is by Camille Pissarro 1894 it's from 19th century uh, it is in the Indianapolis Museum of Art USA and Heraclitus says uh, the unlike is joined together and from differences results the most beautiful harmony temperance now uh, at the beginning of the reading i was talking about your partnerships people coming to you with uh, maybe a shared goal shared desire there are people i was talking about who will take you to uh, that place as well like you were flying over this uh, eagle you know just sit over my wings and i will take you there yes it is not the easiest path but uh, there will be people who who will who may want to be on their side and they want you to on their side so partnerships throughout uh, this year is going to be super important yes we talked about goals yes we talk about um, aim targets um, wishes being fulfilled uh, we talked about a bit uh, how it may feel like uh, when you uh, walk towards that path 
but in the end, the quality of your overall experience, dear Libra, uh, will be determined by the quality of your partnerships. So, you know, it, it all comes down to this fact. We can make readings a thousand times with you. We can look every possible potential to entertain ideas, perspectives, um, you know, we can do that with cards. It's, it's nice, it's fun, it's good. Um, there is definitely a epistemological value, uh, a information value uh, coming out of uh, these divination tools as well. But in, uh, this is like uh, the theory, theory of it. But it all comes down to, in the end, is your practice around these terms. So, now, in some Libras, we talk about how partnerships and relationships will be determining your experience. I will uh, go over some more specific terms now for throughout 2024. Um, that can be some tests and trials within marriages, partnerships, uh, or with people that you have, let's say, potential for union. Or it can be with business partners. Uh, again, this goal partners. Um, so, um, that can be here, uh, this tendency for, uh, um, there is a term for freedom and uh, independent expression. Okay, uh, your the way that you experience, express yourself, actually, your freedom about some subjects and how you are actually passionate about those. And if you also highly vocalize them, uh, it is going to be like highly prized by actually the other person. With, the, with one detail that Let's say if they are passionate, you are like double time, double uh, times passionate, or you know something. The expression then, in order to uh, get to that uh, end goal, let's say, because see, in the end we have the whole year. Uh, it's important that 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 passionate, independent. Uh, this that free free independent expression when it aligns with passion um, they want you to they want to take you there and also you want to take them there you know it is very uh, let's say uh, it is uh, it is going to really serve the, the, to the end goal uh, but of course, there can be challenges as, as well. When it comes to partnerships, uh, there can be twists and turns where it may get troublesome, especially from uh, with regards to the subjects of enterprising, um, you know, this type of things, or with maybe some financial matters. Um, but these are all like maybe part of the challenge, okay? It's like your soul yearns for something. Uh, I actually hear your soul yearns for that intimacy. Okay, intimacy does not necessarily mean in the physical uh, context, but it may also mean uh, emotionally, spiritually, you know, sentiment-wise, communication-wise. Um, it is like, um, you know, at some point you may like stop and um, ask yourself, we have the flame, the ace of cups. These are actually very divinely oriented ca uh, ca uh, cards when it comes to that, uh, what really moves and lives within our hearts and soul. Um, each time we intend to do something, what is really moving us here? Um, it's very important for you to give that feeling to the person uh, that you will be uh, moving together with. Um, 
there can be of course some karmic consequences okay um yeah karmic consequences can happen karmic and encounters can happen um which actually that living heart and the soul wants to experience something um there is like a vibrational pattern around you that you will be creating and also shaped by um this is gonna help you to put those this that primary focus uh, to the things it's like really listen uh listen listen around you know what it really wants to speak with you it's it can be very important that um so some libras i do feel uh, can really study those um ancient teachings or like things being rediscovered historically some texts or it can be some type of a uh, um, book which is going to reveal you uh, one of the ultimate truths that you can uh, see so there is some type of a research I do feel uh, that can be here th there is a here an arrival point but actually this arrival point with your goal um, is the physical manifestation of the year it's actually reminds me the um, journey where we uh, all return to some type of a source um, and this is actually giving your soul throughout the year and that highly enthusiastic energy um, you may be so eager to share your insights enthusiasm with others uh, I do feel like you're gonna receive really good news um, um, you may be searching for a kindred soul and uh, please know that that person is also searching actually you okay so that you can share a journey but it all comes down to temperance here like those uh, unlike parts coming together and their actually differences uh, make the harmony this is isn't this uh, actually a liberal way of putting it together uh, you can at uh, this uh, year 2024 um, as you move in your situations with endurance and strength if you are a single person you can really find I think uh, uh, a true partner which really uh, shares uh, in the end that um, spirit or enthusiasm with you they can be though very different uh, than you but that can be also partners in of course business as well partnerships as well there is this uh, um how to say like normally there are things maybe you wouldn't accept but this year it's like you will be like more tolerant about something when it comes to accepting uh, it's reality you like surrendering it like supporting you know um, because uh, the soul seeks some kind of attain attainment transcendental attainment some also worldly success here like it just got to be with the shepherd card and the nine of cups just fulfilling you know um, Uh, don't worry though some you know okay uh, Libra energy um, as you know uh, Libras are defined by their indecisiveness because they take take so much time to actually weigh on the subject from both sides and pros and cons because they don't want to be unfair to anything um, here though there will be times Libra which when you go it like you know when you go for it some choices become very obvious for you um even like partners or people you that you may be engaging in may have different take on on that the choice will be obvious and um 
at this point when the choices becomes obvious uh, all that indecision I think will just fall so uh, it will be very obvious for you to go for that choice and this can be also have a very educating tendency in your consciousness um, and it may also give you a more a fate for the times ahead uh, plus I do feel there are there can be some legal matters at hand for some of you uh, some things can arise uh, and um, there can be maybe you will receive some courtroom decisions or you will be joining them for those who are still uh, dealing with legal issues uh, well be well prepared for that um, actually the idea here is that if things are like asked from you to move with them uh, you may uh, accompany some people um, and like stand together in in a shared truth for instance um, but if you are yourself gonna initiate a complete lawsuit uh, you may go to uh, how to say it may be like unethical things can be done to you so it will be better for you until uh, wait maybe next year okay just something uh, I want to hear uh, throw out as well uh, so there is this uh, also little adjustments we need to uh, make sure we are uh, making as we are uh, use, using this uh, forces here um, now uh, you are not here like um, how to say uh, stagnating in this year things will actually accelerate so quickly uh, again there can be maybe some little uh, resistance over something that uh, you think that you need to come to some kind of a similar ground with a person but actually that ground I do feel like will be found already um, with legal matters I do feel you need to be careful really um, but you are very much encouraged to embrace the new beginnings uh, potential distractions will be there of course you will uh, see them they will be acknowledging uh, themselves uh, as long as you stay clear-headed okay um, the choices will become obvious I do feel uh, it, it, it is going to be very essential for you to uh, remain mindful uh, of the motivations okay uh, don't give in to any type of temptation here or illusion okay um, you there is a lot of uh, energy here promising to achieve success Libra okay just remain grounded throughout this journey you will be at a very fulfilling place so uh, if you feel like your energy have been really drained all year long in 2023 2024 really will be the year that you will uh, take your vitality back with the sun card here enormous growth ahead Libra friends thank you so much for tuning in I hope you enjoyed this reading uh, so me and Hermit has brought this reading to you take good care and bye bye